I'm Mike Russell, creative director and founder at Music Radio Creative. And I'm here to help you create great sounding audio. So I got into audio listening to radio and listening to the jingles on radio, listening to how they sounded and thinking, I would like to do something like that. And then this great piece of software came along that did it all for me and did pitch bends and frequency changes and I was in heaven and I haven't looked back since. So the software I used that really got me into this was initially Cool Edit Pro, which soon became Adobe Audition, and now it's all I use. One of my favorite parts of what I do is creating content online and teaching uh, as much as I know and obviously learning more so I can hopefully share more knowledge and uh, it's just something I really enjoy doing. So it's a good part of what I do because uh, so many people get involved and provide feedback and want to learn more, so uh, it keeps me inspired. Over the years, I've helped hundreds of thousands master audio production. The top three questions I tend to get from my community are, how can I make my voice sound better? How can I remove the annoying air conditioning, fan, road noise, insert annoying sound here from my audio? And my favorite question is, how do I create this sound? Or how do I create this effect on the voice? Because that makes me think every time, especially when it's something I think, wow, that's really cool. How did they do that? And then either I need to learn it or I need to ask someone, or sometimes it just helps to go direct to the person who made the audio and just say, how did you do that? And it's getting easier with things like denoise and de-reverb, but it's, uh, you know, it's still a question you have to think about. Audio is getting closer to us all the time and technology is just bringing it closer to us. So podcasting is a great example. It's going straight into your ears. It's one person or maybe a couple of people talking directly to you. It's not hello everyone in podcast land, it's hello you, welcome back to the show, let's have a discussion. And now it's, it's becoming a part of our everyday life with uh, things like the Alexa flash briefings. Every day we're waking up, we're asking for our flash briefing and we're learning about the world through audio. My Desert Island features for Adobe Audition, first and foremost, would be the spectral frequency display because you can do so much with it. You can spot heal sounds, so you can remove annoying parrots or sirens from outside just by painting those frequencies out. You can also see a lot of what's going on inside your audio. You can see singing, uh, patterns, tunes, bits like that. So really, really fantastic. The second thing that I would take with me to a desert island is Pitch Bender because it would just keep me entertained for hours. I can speak like this and do all this crazy stuff with my voice. So that would keep me really happy. And then the third thing I would take with me is a recent development, but it would definitely be Adobe Audition Remix. So depending how long I was going to be on that desert island for, I could remix the track to last how long it was going to take before the boat comes to collect me. You can find me online at musicradiocreative.com. I have a YouTube channel at youtube.com slash musicradiocreative. It's just hit 100,000 subscribers. I'm working on the million now. It's a big old slog for that, but uh, audio production is what I teach there using Adobe Audition. I sometimes delve into Premiere Pro, but it's uh, still something I'm very much learning about myself, but Essential Sound is a great part of that, so I featured that. Uh, and yeah, a ton of stuff around Adobe Audition at youtube.com slash musicradiocreative. Let's get stuck in and create amazing audio.